liquor? Coffee? That's coffee. Oh, okay. I drove. Oh, I see, I see. All right, <laughs> anyway, anyway. Oh, don't forget the water bottle. Oh yeah, the La Blue. La Blue. Oh, La Blue. We got the, Trey and I are undecided. Is it Fiacci? Is it Fiocchi? Fiacci. Fiacci. Tomato, tomato. We got the Fiacci RDS 25 red dot sight. Let's read about it a little bit here. Uh, so, it's got a three volt lithium battery or CR2032 and it did come with an extra one. It came with two, that's awesome. And it does have an Allen wrench that's included to adjust the, uh, the red dot. No, I'm sorry, that is fake news. That is to put the red dot on because the covers here serve as the adjustment tool. Forgive me, I spoke wrong. It does have a one inch riser plate here. It does have the wrench here to mount that. And as I mentioned, it did come with two extra batteries. It is a four MOA dot and the sight window is 20 millimeter multi-coated lens. One MOA per click. And again, it is a four MOA dot, 6061 aluminum matte black finish it's a really nice looking hey we want to see the thing don't we? here she is 11 different brightness settings battery right here again as i mentioned the windage and elevation caps here do serve as the adjustment tool also trey and i did well i hope trey and i do not embarrass ourselves as we did on one of the other optics, but we did zero this thing here at about 12 yards. I hope it's still zero. I hope we really actually did. I hope so. And I might just keep this thing on here, but we are gonna do as with the other optics we have here today. Again, most of the stuff and features about this, this is, as I said, the Fiacci RDS 25 red dot. And you can find everything you want Oh, what do you get this on Amazon about 139 something like that and so you can find everything you want to know right there on their website search that red dot we're not going to talk a great deal it is a nice nice good looking dot I mentioned before that on the Trigicon some of the Hollisons I get a splatter look when I see the dot this is a nice crisp dot almost as if it's painted on that glass and so I got this thing set on for brightness. It is an overcast day today that seems to be a very good setting for a day like today. Are you hearing voices? I don't know why my watch is talking to me about brighter. She wanted to be in the video. Yeah, okay. Shut up. <laughs> anyway, it does look good up here on the Uzi Pro 9mm. Cut a couple rounds down range, let you see that it is indeed zero. We're going to take it off of here. Put it on the business end of my JM40 940 Pro 12 gauge, slap it on the end down there, put 25 rounds through it, shake it up a little bit, slap it back on here, see if she held zero. Because at the end of the day, is it that what matters? Does it hold zero? Will it get zero? Will it hold zero? And can it take a little bit of shock? That's what's important. We got it on the Uzi Pro. Let's uh Let's try not to embarrass ourselves. I think we're a little further away than 10 or 11 yards, but either way, that's where you want to be. It's about the length of the hallway in my house. I don't mean nothing by that. No. Oh my God. Ooh, dang. <laughs> Got to give me some slack. It is not easy to shoot this gun. That's why you need your good quality dot up there. But man, when I was able to hold this thing perfectly still, it hit the dead center of that target. Let's get this sucker on the 940 JM. Shock it about 25 times. See if she still holds zero. All right, guys, 25 through the- Fiacci. Fiacci. The RDS 25. Let's see what it looks like on there. I know I got a good look, let's see. Yes, sir. There she is. There she goes. There she blows. All right. 25 through it. That's a 10-4. That is indeed a 10-4. Safety seems to be doing fine. I don't What's know that? what the heck it was doing. It was acting a little weird there. Maybe it got a piece of 
GSR that's six months old in there. Maybe it got some shrapnel in it. Some Dale shrapnel. Yeah. So shrapnel is spelled S H R A P N E L. What I did Shrap there is I Dale. Took, yeah, I, hear. I took nail and I put Dale in its place. Uh, for those that of is you very that are, clever. I like it. For those hanging on by a thread, wondering what I'm doing, that's it. I like it. I like it. One, two, three, four, five. So this should be. 10. I mean, we put four optics and almost and a hundred rounds through a shotgun in only 16 minutes in. That's pretty impressive. 16. I'm calling Jerry tomorrow. See if he's got a spot open on the team. Yeah, he don't. Well, we need a new team. We're kind of a bug, <laughs> you know. This has got to be good for the implants. Oh. You're going to so, be going back to the dentist and talking about uh, Trey? Yeah, they, you have to fill out these forms like, do you smoke? Do you dip? What did you eat? No, I just... Like, no, I don't smoke or dip. Uh, I do something else, though. Yeah. I, uh, you know... I eat lead. I eat lead? Not even close. All right. Well, I, what was I aiming for? At the trash can. Oh. All right. They Last five. It. Yes, sir. Fiatchi RDS 25, I guess that's right. She ate everything we put through it. So the, the Mossberg extra 100 rounds review went well. So no we're issues. 625. I think that's right. Where's your paper at? Here, where's my there handy dandy paper? So if you add 100 to, oh, you don't total them up. So 210, 325, 525, 625, 625 after today. 625. We're going to have to start doing this more often because, man, I want to clean this thing because I really like the shotgun. Yeah. It's, I'm impressed by its performance and its uh, handling of the recoil. For sure, for sure. 625 deep without a speck of cleaning of any kind. That's pretty impressive. You can smell the heat. Smells good, don't it? Mm. Let's get that. Let's get them optics on the on these guns and see if they hold up. I ain't totally sure why Trey's got his Yeti cup up here. <laughs> Is that liquor? Coffee? That's coffee. Oh, okay. I drove. Oh, I see. I see. All right. Anyway. anyway. <laughs> oh, don't forget the water bottle. Oh yeah, the La Blue. La Blue. La La Blue. Got the Fiatchi RDS 25. It's fresh off of the JM Pro 940 12 gauge. The business end, no cracks in the glass here. Everything seems to be in order. The dot is still crisp. The dot is still on. It's on a brightness of four. And we had it zeroed there at about 12 yards, dead center of that target. And I hope that it holds zero because if I'm being honest, I've put quite a few optics up here, including a Vortex Viper. Couldn't seem to get it zeroed. This one seems to be the only one that did zero for me. And I don't know, man, I might, I might hide this somewhere in the house for a special occasion. I don't know. You never know when you'll need it. And I don't mean anything by that. It no. I'd say it's on. That's not bad. <laughs> that was tactical as hey, crap. Let's get all tactile here. <laughs> oh, I mean, you got to get it away from me. You that's, know? that's right. The Fiatche. That's a metal one, too. That would have hurt. Yeah, I mean, it hurt the table. I like the optic. Not even going to lie. We've done a budget friendly optic or two here lately and we didn't have all things nice to say about it. People got angry with us, said we didn't torque them right, we didn't do this right, we didn't do that right. So we kind of tried to set up this thing today where we kind of take ourselves out of the equation except for our shooting. As you can see, that's pretty dang nasty down there. Big uh, time. It held zero perfectly through about 20 rounds, 25 rounds here on the Uzi Pro. 
and after 25 rounds of being shaken by two and three quarter inch 12 gauge I like it love the dot in here if I'm being honest I wish the dot in my Trigicon RMR was as crisp as that dot is don't think it'll show up on camera but just in the case it does I'll let Trey look at it yeah that is a very it's almost as if somebody took a little paintbrush and just dotted that glass it is a good dot I like this optic it's a Mozart dot I like it man um, Fiat RDS 25 I believe that I can highly recommend this optic you know what RDS stands for I don't red dot sight that's pretty clever <laughs> yeah Not really yeah. Um, go pick you one of these up on Amazon got the riser plate in the box cleaning and two batteries two batteries you'll probably never need another battery again a day in your life it will not turn off so be sure that you do turn it off put it on zero brightness and you're good to go I like this I'm really excited found me an optic for my Uzi make sure you hit the subscribe button make sure you like make sure you share with your friends please comment we love to hear from you we love to go back and forth with you kind of josh around if you will let us know what you think anything we missed any questions you might have we'll try to get your answer thanks for watching god bless